Sydney-based Red Baron offers customers both aerobatic adventures and flight training. Students get a taste of high-flying fun over the scenic city of Sydney. I'm the third owner of the Red Baron. Um, it was started back in uh, the early 80s by a guy who had retired from the Air Force and just had an old biplane that he was flying around. Um, it was then bought in the early 90s by my boss at the time, uh, who I was working for, and then I bought it from him uh, about three years ago, and uh, I've been operating the Red Baron since then. We actually refurbished the aeroplane uh, before I bought the air, uh, before I bought the business. Um, that was uh, about 10 years ago. We it's almost due for a, for a, to do it again. But these aircraft were built in 1978 originally, and uh, they uh, they're competition aerobatic aeroplanes. That's what they were built for. Red Baron is, uh, is essentially two companies. It's the flight training, Red Baron flight training, where we teach people to fly from scratch and uh, they can go all the way through to commercial training. And we have an emphasis on aerobatics. So all of our students learn to fly aerobatics, even uh, from lesson one, you're looping and rolling. And if you already have a license and come to fly with us, then you have to learn uh, the aerobatics as part of your, your training with us. Um, and then we have the, uh, the other side of it, which is the adventures. And so if you don't want to learn to fly, but you still want to go for a ride in one of our planes, then we uh, can take you up and take you over the most beautiful city in the world, Sydney, and do uh, some aerobatics afterwards. So it's, it's lots of good fun. We, we love our flying here. I started flying at school, just always interested in flying and uh, started gliding, which is uh, non-powered sort of aeroplanes and then eventually came over to flying power aeroplanes, uh, not these particular ones themselves but just trainers um, and started learning aerobatics at a very young age and then um, eventually became an instructor, so started teaching aerobatics um, as well. Uh, and then moved on to these aeroplanes, which is what we use for the Red Baron Scenic Flights. It's the Pitt Special. It's a competition aerobatic aeroplane um, that we use uh, for most of the Red Baron flights, except for the hands-on ones. We have a hands-on flight as well, which is uh, in our trainers.
learning to fly is not a, a difficult experience. Uh, it's something that obviously takes a lot of practice uh, and a little bit of, uh, I guess, um, academic study. But uh, the bulk of it is going to be principal physical flying. Uh, and obviously flying training schools like the Red Baron offer a program which uh, will basically take a beginner in, start them off with, uh, I guess, uh, easy or beginning um, type flying training and progress you through step by step until you get to more advanced flying. So uh, I'm actually learning to fly purely for recreational purposes. Love aviation and uh, yeah, just enjoy it.